Should I do another W Riz? <laughs> Boys, it's a beautiful day in the city. Who am I kidding? It's like halfway beautiful. It's not entirely beautiful. If it was 100% beautiful, it would be sunny, but it is It is not. It is like halfway sunny. You know what I'm saying? Like a little bit of sun, a lot of bit of clouds. Good news, guys. My mic up setup actually ships in today. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet, but I'll just kind of like like audio check it for you guys. And if it, if it doesn't sound good, then, you know, I'll go for the big boy stuff. I'll actually, like, invest, like, the expensive ones. If this one does the trick for a little bit, then, then I'll, I'll be happy. Not gonna lie, I've been cooking up some ideas that I thought would be hilarious. Of course, they're inspired by other YouTubers, but, like, I just thought it would be funny if I did it myself. It's rare for me to, like, get excited about doing a prank. I have, like, a lot of requirements for them. I'm not as socially good as, like, the other YouTubers. It's hard for me to find the right one. For my requirements, I want to make sure that, like, I'm the butt of the joke and you know i don't really want to bother anyone i don't really want to have security called on me or whatever so i have a few of them that i thought would be hilarious to do i'm gonna try to do it while i'm in detroit lakes all right it's mcdonald's time oh no i need to go to walmart and actually like buy some real like food so i can like start cooking again but we work with mcdonald's for like the convenience sake right you know what i'm saying and plus i got like a a 15 plus deal so like if you get like if you get like orders over 15 dollars, you get either a free 10 piece or a big mac so i chose a big mac this is like a 20 dollar order for 30 dollars worth of food big mac and also a double quarter pounder we're set to go baby Oh, someone's there. Hi there. God damn. It is hot in North Dakota, boys. Well, it's we're technically in Minnesota, but you know what? Who's counting? We're gonna set you over there for a second just so like just so the heat doesn't destroy the camera. Alright, give me a second. Let me cool this car down really quick. This feels like a thunderstorm right now. You know one of those like weather reporters trying to like report something with their microphone and like a hurricane where they had to like yell really loud just for the audio to like be picked up. It's like the most obvious thing ever. They'd be like, alright ladies and gentlemen, it is quite stormy out here in San Francisco. Please keep your kids inside. Definitely not the best weather for the beach right now ladies and gentlemen. It is, it is cold, it is wet, it is windy. Now, the move is we're gonna be heading home really quickly because I want to test out the microphone, but actually another model male. I told you guys how the Lakeshirt shoot was going to be at Detroit Lakes. Well, I also didn't read the part that is going to be potentially at a college. Yeah, that potential turned into a reality. It is actually at the MSUM campus. So on Wednesday, instead of Detroit Lakes, it's going to be at the, like I said, at the MSUM campus. And we're not going to be going to Detroit Lakes and we're not going to be sleeping over at uh, Charles's place. But I just talked to Charlie. I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to go have a sleepover at their place anyway because why? not i want to film with them and stuff and you know just mess around or whatever that's the update for the model mail model mail done and then if you can remember remember to keep smiling we broke up a month ago you were with me i'm selfish i know should have broke it up the day myself you didn't deserve me should I do another W Riz? <laughs> I can sing it though if you want. Bring it over to my place. You don't know what you did. I don't know what you did. Did to me. Your body lie away. Speaks to me. Oh. Uh, the song is so high actually. Let me try it. Shooting for stars when I couldn't make a killing. Didn't have a time, but I always had a vision. Guys, I can't, I can't stress this enough. It is hot out there, boys. It's like humid. It feels like the Philippines, you know. Either way, so we got the package. Package from Amazon. This time to check this out. So I ordered a voice recorder and also a lapel mic. The idea is that I get the like specific voice recorder so I can just put it in my pocket and then I plug in the lavalier mic into like right here. Pretty much like how mic'd up YouTubers do it, you know what I'm saying? This is like my introduction to being mic'd up. Okay, so let's start with step one. This is the digital voice recorder. This thing also has its own mic. So if I really wanted to, I could just use this as a mic, but that's not the idea that we're 
getting at here for this type of video. What we're gonna do here, so apparently this also comes with an SD card. I think it's like 64. Here's a little device. Oh, it feels sturdy, boy. I thought this was just made of plastic. I saw like a review of this and I thought, oh man, this is like a little plastic thing. Bro, it's metal. <laughs> it's there. Welcome. I can just start recording. Oh, I can. We're gonna have to sync this up right here really quickly. The fun part of this video is that I don't know like how this is gonna sound like until I'm done recording it and while I'm in the editing booth. So this could sound really terrible or like decent or good. Who knows? This is the microphone right here for it. So and then we press that save. Okay, there we go. I watched like a review of this and it actually doesn't sound too bad. So what the normal mic'd up YouTubers do, like the big dogs, what they do is they have like a, uh, they have like the lapel mic of course, but they also have uh, a transmitter and a receiver. This is a transmitter technically, if I did the transmitter receiver option, this would be the transmitter because this, because this plugs into the, into the lapel mic. The receiver would be directly connected into the camera. So like every time this records, this would turn on. So I would, you know, I'd start recording it. I didn't go with that option one because it's pretty expensive i could buy it but the most important reason why i went with this route is because uh, i want dual channels so i'm still recording with like the normal microphone that i normally record with but i also have this in a case that like the the microphone stuff malfunctions i still have that as a backup at least i have like a safety net you know because i'd hate to have to completely scrap all the footage because you know the audio is not recording it's bad for me specifically because i'm uploading every single day so if there's any error like, the video's done. I went with this route, the most, you know, the, the, the safest route. Now we're gonna test it out with this. This is actually a two-pack. If one of the lapel mics ever break, uh, I can, you know, there's a backup. Let's test out the audio right now. All right, let me sync this up here really quick. Yeah. Now we're recording on the lapel mic. Hopefully it sounds decent. I don't know. If it doesn't, then it is what it is. I'm gonna have to, uh redo this completely but this is what it sounds like i'm gonna try to use the pop filter for it and we're gonna test this out here really quickly we're gonna test out the audio or what it sounds like okay so for the first test uh, i had the microphone like literally right here so obviously it's gonna be really loud it literally sounds like you know if like if someone's all the way up in your ear right here and speaking normally that's kind of what it sounds like we're gonna do this like the actual way where i have like the microphone i'd say about right here i don't have masking tape i have to use electrical tape for now all right here we go this is the complete mic'd up setup so like i'm all the way right here and you can still hear me as nicely the audio is still nice i could literally be all the way back here i'm gonna go on i'm in the living room right now and you could see you guys could still hear me I do want to test this out when I'm at Walmart, so prepare for some content like this, all right? This is this is what it sounds like. Hopefully it does, uh, hopefully it sounds all right. It actually does sound pretty decent. Of course, I'm going to take this audio with a grain of salt because um, this isn't like high quality audio, I guess, or this isn't a high quality speaker. So I'll see what it actually sounds like in the editing booth. <laughs> Alright boys, so we're mic'd up now. You can see the tape is still good. We're gonna turn this on real quick. It's time to harass Walmart. No, I'm not going to. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. I forgot I don't have to like talk so loud anymore because like, like I said, you know, I got the microphone here, but literally two things that I gotta grab. Well no, three things. I gotta I gotta grab some masking tape. I wanna get my own for the videos. Alright, so after two trips from 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 the gym because I left this at the gym. I noticed that as soon as I got to like the, the apartment and I'm like, ah, uh, bro, I'm gonna go edit this right now. Just see what happens. See, see if I like it, see if I like the audio. If I don't, then we might have to make some returns happen, but I, I, it's, it's sounding pretty good. So I'm done with the boy now. It's done me well for today. All right, I'm gonna edit this whole video and I'm gonna add a clip of like my afterthoughts, all right? <laughs> All right, so yeah, it was garbage. <laughs> it literally sounded like a phone call, dude. So that's not gonna cut it for the big Aldwin. So I think think I got it down now. I messed around with the settings a little bit. And if the audio is still bad right now, then I'm gonna completely scrap this idea and I'm gonna buy like the one, like the actual like expensive one. I'm gonna actually go to Guitar Center tomorrow and grab one right now. But if the audio sounds good right now, then I will keep this temporarily. Turn down the sensitivity a little bit. Kind of tweaked it a little bit the best that I can. You know, I don't really wanna buy one right away without trying to like get the best out of this if this sounds good then w's in the chat i'm gonna check this out right now but if not i'll give you guys an update in just a second all right all right scrap it completely uh i'm gonna buy the what is it the tascam d d bro tascam drtl no 
Bro, what? Tascam DR10L Pro. That's the one that like everyone uses, so I'm gonna buy that tomorrow and just go with that, you know, go big or go home type deals. So this is my introduction to the mic'd up community. Hello everyone. If I want to introduce myself to the community, I want to make sure that I'm doing it right. So I'm going to go buy it tomorrow. I'm going to go to bed now because I got to wake up early. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.